on a hot Thursday, summer night, August 11th, 2022, I attended a meet in North McKinney. Lots of wonderful cars and really good kids. It was an ominous full moon night and we were having so much fun until these guys showed up. Hey, hello all you wonderful car fanatics out there in YouTube land. I am Burke. You're watching Road Odyssey. Please subscribe down below. I would appreciate that very much. And this video is in reference to uh, possibly a park up front in a Facebook event that was held in McKinney, Texas. So that's kind of a North Texas, definitely North Dallas area. And... I just happened to be across the street off 75 Central from this event, and I kept seeing all these cars and motorcycles, you know, going on the to the this great big parking lot on the other side of the highway. And it's like, uh, eventually, I finally looped over there and to see what was going on, and it was a fairly good size event. Like I said, a lot of motorcycles, uh, BRZs, 86s. Mustangs, Challengers, uh, pickup trucks, all kinds of stuff was out there. Really, really cool cars and very, very nice people. Of course, they were all the young crowd and they were doing all the young crowd stuff, which I don't mind. Um, you know, they're not hurting anybody or doing anything all that terribly nasty wrong. Um, but I do have a few opinions that I'd like to insert into this video, and I apologize for such a long introduction, but I just got to <laughs> let you know what I think. So anyway, let me go ahead and get into this. Here we go. I'd like to start the video just looking around. No, no, no. Got to focus on the cars first. Nice Civic Type R. Very cool C5 Corvette. BRZ. GR86, very nice cars. Of course, there are always the Mustangs and the Camaros and all that stuff. Lots of nice motorcycles out there. Enjoyed looking at those. They were pretty fun. And there was this uh, Challenger, Kia Stinger right next to it, I guess. Uh, the owners of the Challenger were very nice. And, you know, there's just all kinds of really cool cars out there and pickup trucks. So, really enjoyed looking at these three. That was a nice little display. This seemed to be the main party truck, and it was wonderful. I was lucky enough to capture some video clips of burnouts. So, first off were the motorcycles. I seriously failed on getting some of these guys. You can see where they did do their burnouts, but let's move on to some that I did capture. some revs now this worked out fairly well i think you'll like this let's begin with this interestingly wrapped bmw it's pretty decent <laughs> now this nissan z outstripped everybody on the road Thank you. 
All right, I hate to bore you guys, but let's talk a little bit about safety. I primarily want to just suggest that everybody learn to be more safety vigilant. When a car does a burnout, everybody needs to be several feet away from wherever that car might be heading. This big truck had just done a really nice burnout and yet there were still people all around the front fenders, so not a good idea. And if you're going to drive like this, you need to have somebody watching up front for cross traffic or stopping the cross traffic. Going back to the truck burnout, that's a terrible place. To do that, find some place where people are seriously out of the way and cars are out of the way and you can watch surrounding traffic better. When leaving an event, man, be super careful. This is awful. I'm pretty sure the Mustang was watching out for the Challenger, which is great. If you're on the corner and you're watching these cars, the drivers need to watch for hand signals from the people on the curb, and y'all on the curb could help direct the traffic to some degree. So from my safety ideas, that should tell you why police come in and bust this stuff up. If you do not have safety experience or if you are not safety minded, the cops have to assume that y'all are not experienced enough to do the things that you're doing safely. So they are responsible for your safety and everybody else. Therefore, they have to bust up any meat where y'all do things that are a little bit out there. So try not to be mad at the cops or anybody else. They're just trying to keep everybody alive. All right, that'll do it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. And hey, all you young folks, have fun and subscribe. I would appreciate that very much. I guess with that, Relax, take it easy, and I will see you later. Bye.